know something, don't you? You know what's out there. I have a hunch. Yes? Come on, Bill. You never do anything halfway. What do you think we'll find? If we're lucky, another prize. If we're very lucky, something that'll end this miserable war. You're talking over my head, mate. Listen, Sean, I have no idea what we're going to find. But I do know that whatever it is, the Templars can't have it. Do you regret anything, Desmond? Like what? Running away? Leaving your parents behind, finding a shit job and pretending to be productive? What's it like spending your whole life avoiding hard decisions? Come on. Sure, you're an assassin. But it wasn't your choice. Do you have a point? I want to know. If you regret anything. Sure. I wish I'd been more patient with my parents. I wish I'd listened. And Lucy. Maybe things could have been different if I'd... I'm not sure. Thank you. For what? For making sense. Sean, you feeling okay? Sure, yeah, yeah, of course. No, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're assassins, after all, aren't we, eh? Hey? Why should we be surprised if one of us dies every now and again? Every death is a tragedy to somebody somewhere. What I want to know is... Is Desmond worth all this trouble? You know, what, what is he? Is he the, the chosen one? Is that it? Little Jimmy special? Some bollocks like that? I'm afraid not. But what he has is rare. His genes contain high concentrations of first civilization DNA. Only about one in ten million are so lucky. Oh, the bleeding effect. Is that part of it? I believe so. I wish I could say we knew about his gift earlier. But it was the Templars who realized this. And they found him first. left Constantinople and set sail for the interior of Anatolia, to a region called Cappadocia, where Manuel is training his soldiers. If I am lucky, I will not be alone, for there may be Ottoman spies in the area waiting to strike. But, as ever, I put stock only in myself, and hold the memory of dear Sophia close to my heart. Claudia, you would laugh to hear the racing thoughts of your brother now. I have come to admire Sophia with more affection than I thought possible. After the death of Christina, something withered in me. But that feeling, that capacity for love, has returned. I adore Sophia, but dare not drag her into this life of mine. Not without fear of hurting her, or driving her away. of an army here, and no signs of Tarek's men.
Never mind. Easy now. Tarek sent me. Only you? Why not more? I am enough. Where are your men? Captured by Byzantines over a week ago. I was dressed to look like a slave and managed to escape. But the others? Are you a capable fighter? I like to think so. Well, when you are certain, come find me. We caught another of the Sultan's spies lurking about. A woman this time, disguised as a harlot of low birth. <laughs> Sending his harem girls now, eh? It seems the Sultan is running out of skilled fighters. Where did you take her? Inside. Into the prisons. But she won't last long. Not with Shakulu in charge. <laughs> How soon before my soldiers are trained to use those guns? A few weeks at most. Janissaries will know I have betrayed them by now. But do they have the resources for retribution? Doubtful. The Sultan's battle with Selim commands most of their attention. <laughs> ah! What the hell is that spell? 
Apologies, Manuel. Some of these Ottoman prisoners are so... fragile. <laughs> Shakuru, try to moderate your anger. I know the Sultan humiliated your people, but there is no need to spit on men who are beneath us. Mm. You, take the woman from the prison and bring her to the chapel. Sakulu, I don't have the key. Find it! Who has the key? You? I think Nicholas has. He's on leave in the market. Christemu, I'd like to run that man through with a spear. To yourself, a taxi. taken prisoner. Poor men. That Turkmen renegade did this. Shah Kulu. I'll kill him! Wait! not cooperate very well. I'm here to rescue my men, not make friends. Right there. That armor is too thick for bullets. I will have to get in close. Jonas, we have to help him.
murder deserve no pity. <laughs> Can you walk? Evet. The rifles you brought, they should be destroyed. Most of them don't actually work. But the gunpowder is real. We could not fake that. Bene. Keep out of sight until you hear the explosions. Then, you run. Explosions? If you do that, all hell will break loose. You will panic the entire city. See, si. I am counting on it. And then what? Then I find Manuel Palea Logos. Don't think I want to... Where's he from? I will kill you. Why do we always get a friendly and shit that I'm here? Go! Now, go! <laughs> 
Sabotage, Manuel. You need to take cover. Get out of my way. Citizens, soldiers, compose yourselves. Do not give in to fear. We are the true shepherds of Constantinople. We are the lords of this land. We are Byzantines. Corio, stand fast. Do not let anyone break it. Stop that man! Put it down! advantage of a poor and displaced people, using us to further your own vain quest. But we fight for dignity, assassin. We fight to restore peace to this troubled land. Templars are always quick to talk of peace, but very slow to concede power. Because power begets peace, Flaka. It cannot happen in reverse. These people would drown without a fair hand to lift them up and keep them in line. There he is. The monster I came to kill. 
My next cut will be your last! <laughs> I should have been Constantine's successor. He had so many plans. Your dream dies with you, Manuel. Your empire is gone. Ah. But I am not the only one with this vision, assassin. The dream of our order is universal. What a man, Byzantine. These are only labels. Costumes and facades. Beneath these trappings, all Templars are part of the same family. Enough prattling. I am here for the Masyaf key. Then take it. Take it. And seek your fortune. See if you get within 100 leagues of that library before one of us finishes you off. Manuel, last of the Palaer Logi. I should not have put him in charge of our Masyaf expedition. He was an arrogant man. Impossible to keep in line. You disappoint me, Ahmed. Why are the Templars? Because I am tired of all of these pointless blood feuds that pit father against son, brother against brother. To achieve true peace, mankind must think and move as one body. With one mastermind. The secrets in the Grand Temple will give us just that. And Altair will lead us there. Delusions. Altair's secrets are not for you. I am not interested in arguing, Ezio. I am here for the Masyaf keys. Keys? Are there more than this one? So I have heard. Perhaps I should ask someone who knows better. Sophia Sarto. Is that her name? She knows nothing. Leave her be. We shall see. I will kill you if you touch her. I know you'll try. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nicola Polo, our time together was brief, I know. But I have faith this Codex will answer the many questions you have yet to ask. Altair, this gift is... invaluable. Grazie. So? Where will you go next? Back to Constantinople for a time. We will establish a guild there before returning to Venezia. Your son Marco will be eager to hear his father's wild stories. Uh, he is a little young for such tales, but one day soon, see? Father, a vanguard of Mongols has broken through. The village is overrun. Nicolo, your cargo and provisions are waiting for you by the village gates. We will escort you there. Uh, thank you, Mentor. Ready the catapults and watch for my signal. Stay close. Let's move. This way. Father, are you hurt? Uh, give me a moment. <clears throat> uh, the end of an era. When I was very young, I was foolish enough to believe that our creed would bring an end to all these conflicts. 
If only I possessed the humility to say to myself, I have seen enough for one life. I have done my part. Then again, there is no greater glory than fighting to find the truth. We are ready. A last favor, Niccolo. Take these with you and guard them well. Hide them if you must. Artifacts? Of a kind. They are keys. Each one imbued with a message. A message? For whom? I wish I knew.